Hey, it's JC1424 once again with July 2019's Monthly Music episode. Keep in mind, I don't care if you don't like what I listen to. You shouldn't care if I don't like what you listen to. And it seems that the second half of the year is much more musical than the first. Number five, A Death in the Family by Sum 41. I'll tell you all your lies will tear you apart. While I'm still excited for Order and Decline coming out on July 19th, I am unsure if it'll do anything more for me than just vibe well, because while I do enjoy them doing this pop punk metal thing, a theme of you're dead to me and you better watch your back prevents this from actually blowing me away. Number four, 96 Quite Bitter Beings by Camp Kill Yourself. What a nice, wholesome message for a band name, right? I found this song via Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3, a game I haven't actually played in ages, so I don't know what made me think of it, but the guitar riff slaps and the vocal production is really fun. The meaning to this song, though, is kind of the story of a guy showing up to a city and then finding that the population is this hostile, violent cult. Which is, um, fine. Number three is Murder by Power Man 5000. Now you're coming around, yeah, you're coming around and you're found. Okay, I promise not all the music in this video is dark. Just bear with me. I saw these guys live last Friday with Kayla and got me this shirt. That was a big old pile of holy fuck. But anyways, beforehand I decided to order their album Destroy What You Enjoy, which is apparently the least acclaimed by fans. I'm not sure why. They did just take a break from industrial metal to do something more organic with a rebellious focus. And they were also doing something like that with Transform, except they still had a lot of those electronics in there. But number two is Shine a Little Light by the Black Keys. If it were sentient, I'd have a one night stand with the guitar on this song. And that ain't all this song has got. It's got a really driving bass, and the chorus comes crashing in like angels just rocking out. And this was the first song on their new release, which was okay in my opinion, but not one song on that album stuck out as good as this one did. Number one, Don't You Worry by 311. I was unaware 311 was releasing another record until I stumbled upon a leak to the whole thing, which isn't supposed to be out for another week. But I've done listen to it seven times and pre-ordered it because it's kind of really freaking good. Like this song. Very musically progressive, mellow, and then powerful and brilliant. And these guys also really have a way with their instruments. Thanks for watching this monthly music vid, and episode over.